This is so awesome. Look at that. What is that? I haven't actually... Why is my gun... Okay, let me see. Two, three, four... Ah, oh, four shots. That's not bad. Greetings, guys and girls and fellow gamers. My name is games for cakes and welcome to Empyreon. In the last episode, we... I don't remember what we did in the last episode. What did we do in the last episode? Yes, we rushed some towers. Um, the reason I couldn't remember is because two days have passed and I actually haven't played. Look where I am! Look at me! I uh, decorated the house a little bit. I played a little bit along so we don't have... So you guys have some exciting things to do and look at. We expanded our... Um, whoops. Our base a little bit on the outside. We uh, started the farm. But we are still trying to make seeds. So we're not trying to eat as much of that stuff because we're, we're trying to make a lot of seeds. Okay. Oh, the coffee's already gone. Now, they also added new animals. The turrets. Look at this. I built some turrets. Oh, I never showed you this. Yes, this is so awesome. This is so awesome. Look at that. What is that? I haven't actually... Why is my gun... Okay, let me see. Two, three, four... Ah, oh, four shots. That's not bad. I'm kind of a bit weak. Now here we have a proper dinosaur here. That's brilliant. And it's all green, so it actually fits into it. Don't look at me with this sad eyes. It's looking at me going... You know you shouldn't have killed me. I will haunt you. Oh, hello! That was lovely of you that you have so much meat on you. Mmm, delicious. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna survive on some meat, basically, until... we um, can get the farm properly going and have enough seeds planted. And I have tons and tons of, uh, like between this episode, last episode and now, we have actually tons of materials that we gathered and I had to make spoiled food, I had to mine a lot of ore and had to, I actually finished all the towers on the whole planet, yeah, as far as I know. So there was, they don't show up on the map, it's really sad, but um, I didn't have to restart my game by the way, all the changes got into it, yeah. So let's go here and make, um, this is is my yeah this is a bit funny like the it sometimes when you open it looks a bit weird yeah okay it seems to have fixed itself okay aqua fruit actually drops now from the flower monsters but we're here for food so let's put raw meat in and i always cook ham because ham is what you need for the dino stew and until i can make dino stew i just cook ham and eat it. So if I ever can make dinosaur, I just have the ham already available. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that will cook all that. So we have some ham there. We are going to make more seeds out of these guys. Not out of these. Oh, I have one more meat. And let's do one more ham. So. Oh, I have a sprout. Aqua fruit. Okay, so let's take the aqua fruit and um, aqua fruit and make some sprouts out of it. One, two. Okay. Yep. Then we want to do a space durian. Nice. And a perthing fruit. And make some corn as well. I just make loads of seeds of everything, so I have tons and tons of seeds, and that way we can make a little square farm for every single thing. So pumpkins and wheat. Brilliant. Yeah, we have loads of... Well, we don't have actually loads, but we have loads of water. So rock dust and purified water and spoiled food. So we can make another 10 of that. And maybe another 10, so 20. Yeah, I have to spoil food. So I'm going to have to actually go on some hunt. Oh, I can make canned vegetables actually as well. Which is 150 food. The tomatoes I have for this. So I can use raw meat directly. 
Or I can still... That's very good. So once we have all the stuff going, we can actually make whatever food we want. And I think, as Cage uh, told me bef uh, in the past, which I didn't realize, dinos do... I always dismissed it. It actually seems to be best food. Now, of course, once we get to a certain point, we want to make... Um, that's why I'm doing the flour, to make bread, so I can make emergency rations. Because emergency rations, once you have a lot of them, they're really, really good food when you go exploring, because they don't expire, they don't have a... A run of time they give you 500 food which is like basically your whole food meter that that's basically it so uh, let's take all that food out let's take the sprouts out okay there we go nice let's take that out and let's put the ham in the fridge might as well just eat some oh we have some more raw meat in there excellent well, we might as well leave that in, like, for the tomatoes or whatever. We have more wheat and perthing fruit and corn. That's good. So, wheat, perthing fruit and corn. So, there we go. Corn, perthing fruit, and wheat. And we have some coffee beans, which we find, but I don't want to make coffee sprouts, whatever you call it, yet. Excellent. So, I'm just waiting for these two guys to... Um, actually, let me turn that on. There. Oh, there we go. So we finish this. We're gonna wait for the corn and the perthing fruit, and then uh, we should be good to go. Now let me just eat something in the meantime. Um, one, two. I think we need three. One, two. Here we go, and here we go. We also want to make a few more. Um, we have some lights, and we need nine more growing plants so let's do 10 and 1 uh, sorry I mean 1 yeah and then ah damn it oh no we need them actually ah crap it was the right order there we go it's a bit awkward like because you can't reshuffle things it would be great to just say hey I want to put this over there and this over there and blah 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 so um yeah that's it brilliant so let's put the ham over here. I think we need one more ham, do we? Nice. I might as well take another one. Sweet. Okay. So the animals respawn as far as I know. So you, you do have, in a way, an endless supply of food, which is great. So you don't feel under pressure. And this has grown nicely. Very, very good. Now what I want to do is I want to build another one of those... Um, blocks yeah I, and i intentionally built them i know it's not space efficient but i want it to look nice as well so what we do in this episode we're going to build actually the farm itself so what we need we need i have a couple of more blocks I'll show you now why um i want to make another one of those here on the side let me just get that Okay, hang on. Uh, so how many do I need? I have the gap in I have the gap here, which is one. So I have that already. So say this is the gap. I need one block for the going up, then another block, one, two, so I can't count. One, two, three. See we need the block so we can count accurately. But it's a bit annoying that it's so big. So one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so we need five more. And then we want the gaps, so we need six more. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. And this mountain is a bit weird, okay? It keeps spying out on me. So I do this. Okay, and all of a sudden the whole mountain goes invisible and you fall through it. And it's like, seriously? So I don't know why it does that. It's, it's, it, ha it happens to a lot of people, like when they were drilling at the MS Titan, for example. That all of a sudden whatever they were mining on triggered a recalculation of the environment or something and boom, everything went invisible. 
Now, logging on and off doesn't always fix that. Sometimes it does, sometimes it don't. So it's something to keep an eye on and I would just say, be careful, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I want to see if I can do that smart now from that side. So this here, ah, come on. And then holding shift, is it shift? No, it's alt, is it? Hang on, you see down, oh, here we go, yeah. Now, you hold uh, control, and control basically lets you make an area, and because I started over there, it will actually build it under the mountain up to here. And it used all the blocks, and I probably didn't have enough blocks today. So there's probably somewhere here something not uh, done. Let me see. Not so far so good actually, it's holding up nicely. Oh, sometimes you get these freak... Um... See, this is what I mean by recalculation of the terrain. This is not really... This is weird, okay? It's very weird. There, boom, again. And sometimes it recalculates and the whole mountain disappears. Literally, like, for miles, it's gone. It's very weird and scary. So uh, let's actually see if we had enough uh, materials to build at least up to here because we need to build our farm. Okay, I think that's... Oh, yes, there we go. There's the gap. We weren't able to finish this. So that is actually not too bad. We only... Oh, look, you see? See? What did I tell you? Look at this. You can actually jump now through this. And this is missing. But if you go up on the mountain, there's nothing missing. It's there. But if you go here, it's not. And sometimes just uh, touching it fixes it, but sometimes it removes nearly the whole mountain. So... This is something the devs are going to have to keep an eye on, I would say, definitely. Um, okay, so let's put some lights out here. Let's put these standing lights out, because we like them. And um, let's put one here as well. I hope that light will reach the platform down there. Yes, it is. Very nice. And we're going to do another one of those and those. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to queue up some more uh, blocks. And while we do that, I already made windows and window sides because I want to build the actual farm room, which is going to be cool. So I made ammunition and a shotgun because somebody was telling me for animals on the planet, don't waste your, uh, a rifle because you take like five, six shots every time or something. And apparently with the shotgun, you take them out much quicker. So the laser rifle, for example, took four shots on the big guy, which is 105 damage each time. So that's like, holy crap, that's like over 400 damage. Say he has 400 health. The shotgun, tier two, only does 80 damage. So I don't know why it would do, I don't know. Why would it do less damage? Just to make the ammunition costs the same. No, actually, fair enough, yeah. But, ah, well, you know, I never had a shotgun before, so let's try that might as well always try things out now we're gonna put some lights up here as well and we need uh, the windows and we need the other windows where did I have the other windows here okay now what I want to do is I want to basically that's why I dug it out so far I want to have here this is where I want the wall to be like that okay that you can see through it. And I want to be able to walk inside it with enough space and have a door here. So that's why I basically build it here like that. I probably could do it here. Is it better here? So let me see. If we do it here, I think it is better actually here. Because then we can build a door right in the middle, which is actually much better, I think. And we want to have two room here so we have to build until oh okay so that spaceship is in the way so let me just fix that i'm gonna make a proper landing pad in the next episode 
So let me just make sure I'm not banging into anything. So let's just turn it sideways. Okay. There you go. And we leave it on though for the extra lights. Okay. Now it's not bright, very, very, very bright, is it? So let's put some more lights um, up on the walls. Um, let me see. Or will we just put them here on the ground for now? We can always... Yeah, let's put them on the ground for now. There we go. And I suppose we can put one here. That should give a good bit of light. And another one here. Excellent, yeah, that, that gives actually enough light. Pretty cool. And now let's continue. So what we want to do is we want to build to approximately here. So let's turn this. No, not, not like that. Yeah, like that. So let's put that here. That's actually very... Yeah, I like that. That's good. So this will be here. I'm just trying to get to the corner. So the, the door will be here. So this will be here. And then turning it... No turning it back. We just have to make sure we line it up right. There. Excellent. That's actually very nice. I like it. That is very lovely. And then we can build a door right here. So, okay. So let's queue up some... Um, oh, I have more glass paints that I made. Let me just deselect this. Glass paints and um, oh, crushed stone from all the mining, crushed stone, and might as well, there we go, and let's make about, uh, let's make 20 more of those. Now, um, what was I going to do with the farm? Okay, so we have more, more of these guys. And eventually we're going to have so many that we can completely restructure our farm. So in the moment I just want them to grow, grow, grow. And um, randomly I don't really care until I have enough. Um, so let's put a, a tomato down here. And yeah, let's put two... To let's, let's just put uh, both tomatoes down and then put um, the durian fruit down because we need the durian fruit most probably so let's do it there as well and then the perthing fruit nice we get four one two three four and once i have nine seeds of something i can start uh, rearranging things coffee is done very good anyway so we probably don't have enough room on the other side because i want to do the same thing there with three free so i need a hell of a lot more blocks which also means I need probably more metal plates, do I? Um, let me see. Yeah. So, we have plenty of iron. This is all what I got from the towers. I got all this from towers. It's insane, okay? The towers had so much loot. I mean, I destroyed about 10, 15 towers. I mean, look at this. 250. 25 control devices. 78 computers. 45 reactor cores, 20 power cells, that is insane. Some of these towers had actual power engines in it, uh, sorry, generators. Awesome, absolutely awesome. Tons and tons of stuff. So let's just make um, 50, sure, let's make, uh, make 20 more. There we go, we have enough blocks now. And windows and what I want to do with the windows is I want to get them to a certain level and then go um, you know do the um, let me see no not this not this this way there we go Excellent. And why? Oh, my battery's out. I have to get batteries. Where do I have the batteries? I don't have them here. I have them inside. Let me actually show you around uh, uh, a little bit as well, um, once I fix the lights, actually. Yeah, it's all dark in here as well. I have a container here somewhere. Uh, sorry about it being so dark. Oh, do I have a light? I think I have a light on this. Yes. So let's get the fuel packs, which I have tons of. 
And yeah, we have that in here. Very good. Let me just fill up on fuel tanks again. Here we go. And nice. And now we have fuel for oh power usage on. And we have fuel for another half an hour. So we need actually a big bigger fuel tank. Now uh, let me show you around upstairs. If you actually look at the top here, I have currently the turrets turned off because they now start actually shooting at the flower monsters or whatever. And sometimes these guys come very close and I don't want them to shoot each other or the base. So I have them turned off for the moment. But this is anyway, this is what they look like and they're really awesome. I have them right here on top. I never gave you the two every day. I'm really rude. And look at this inside here. Little bookshelf, kitchen area, as you already seen. Okay, we have nine more of those. Very good. And we have one more light. We need some more gun of fr uh, food, so let's put these guys in there. And we have more coffee. Very nice. And here we have um, just gas, um, fuel packs, a little bit of stuff that I made. Look at this. Now, this is actually pretty cool. Let me just put some light on the situation so you can actually see what is going on. I think we might want to put light here. And we want to put a light here. Look at that. So I dug down. Isn't that lovely? The stairs. I really don't like stairs. The I hope the devs are going to fix that. If you walk right into stairs, he actually jumps all the way down. And if you have a very, very long staircase, he will break his legs and actually get damaged. So down here, I'm working on... Um, this uh, floor or whatever you call it it's like a decorative block and um, it looks awesome I this took me a while to get down but I wanted to get deeper so I'm not too close to the surface in case I get attacked or whatever and this is gonna be a reception area and then from the reception area you can get into hallways on either side and there will be the sleeping quarters okay or like a a room where you can hang out, you know, like with seats and um, Haldemar actually, like, uh, he, he built an awesome spaceship and he gave me some ideas actually when I looked at his insights. So Haldemar, thank you very much. You're awesome. That was uh, really cool. I'm gonna actually uh, link the video in the description. I have to remember that. If I don't do that, please give out to me in the comments and remind me that I wanted to do that. I'm trying to remember it. I will link you to the space station that he was showing off that I really enjoyed. Uh, very much. He did a good job in building that. Okay, so enough time wasted. Let's continue with our uh, little farm experiment. And we have... Did we pick up the blocks? Yes, we did. Okay, so let's get going on that. Come on. And we need these blocks. So we need these blocks first here. So... That's the corner. So one, two, three, corner block. Then turn. Okay, it's turning it that way once. And then one, two, three, corner block. Turn again. Is that one, two, three? Yeah. One, two, three, corner block, turn. And one, two, three. Now we can go up here. And I don't think I have any corner blocks on me, do I? No, I have to craft some. Okay, that's fine. We don't need them right now. Now, we're gonna get these guys. And again, hold down control. And then you can just place all nine at the same time. Now, uh, how do you get these up? It's actually quite simple. The least amount wasted is you just click left and hold left and drag up. And build three up. Three high. And then just take the last two out. Oh, sorry. There you go. And then we can put the light underneath. Brilliant. And now we can put more of those guys down. You can put more corn down. And we can put more wheat down, I suppose. One, two, three. And this is all mixed, but like I said, um, there will be another row of that over here. 
and then we have a, a huge farm, a huge six by uh, three by three farm, and that should be enough for everything. So yeah. I know I could make this just a very gigantic long farm, but I don't want to. I want to have each of them to have a 3x3, three three, which should be um, enough, I suppose, or I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it progresses. We'll see. I'm not promising anything. So let's just continue on that window here first. We want this gone, because that's wrong. Okay. And let's place this window all the way down. Again, we get stuck now. Because... Why does it do that? Why is there always something randomly broken? I, I don't get it. I just don't get it. Nothing falls on it. Nothing destroys it. But hey-ho. Now we need to make more room. Hopefully the mountain will not glitch out again. As long as I'm not on it, I don't actually care. <laughs> Okay, we have to be careful with the light. Oh, yeah, we have to be careful with the light. Actually, if it floats, it floats. Very nice. That will do. It's actually very nice that it floats because it gives us more light. Very nice. I like it. Oh, look at this. This looks just beautiful. This is so, this is such a beautiful sight. When Estus uh, rises up there in the morning. This is just amazing. Anyway, we want to get more room here. You get these glitches, just go over them. The reason you get these glitches is for the same reasons as earlier. You see, like that, where it just burns, like comes right out of the wall, like that is very simply because of the recalculation of the terrain. So you just... You know, there you go. Oh, I destroyed the light. There you go. Get some stone. And now we should be able... Actually, I'm gonna use the flattening tool. Oh, shit. I pressed, pressed the wrong button. <laughs> yeah, okay, now I need to use the removal tool again. I pressed the wrong button. Um, hopefully it will be daylight soon, then we're gonna continue in this corner, because it's too dark and I know you guys can't see. So let's just continue here, and build it up to here. And then, what I want to do is, I want to probably have one more row on top. Let me see, yeah, one more row on top. But it's very hard, so we have to climb on top of it. There we go. Ugh, seriously? It's like balancing on a bloody rope. Seriously? Seriously. There we go. Now, can I walk backwards with it? Ah, yeah, it doesn't matter. We can do it like this now. So we do a second level, like that. Okay, and then we do the one for... That is the wrong way around. That actually looks better. Oh, I like that, because it actually matches the corner. Yeah, this one looks like it's offset, so... Well, we put the door in first and then see what looks better. Yeah, exactly, we do that. And then what I want to do is I want to go up on top of that. If I can. Nice. And build one of those guys. Like... Okay, that's... Let me just build two beside each other. Uh, come on. No. No. Over there to the... To the left. Left. Yeah, like that, you plonk. Okay. And that then... Build it like that. Is that does that look okay from the outside? Well, we obviously remove um, this guy here. Actually, that does not look okay because that looks offset as well. Everything looks offset. That's awful. Oh, 
Why does everything look offset? Is that a way of turning it maybe around? Does that look better? I think the problem is, is that this is this way, so it should actually be on the inside, yeah. I think that's the problem. So if you go to this, yeah, I think that's the problem, really. Yeah. Crap. Okay, sorry about that. I had, I had to stop the recording there for a second and start it again. Uh, my apologies. Now, let's wrap it up and... Um, Yes, so we went through the farming, uh, went through a little bit of that. We didn't get as much building done as I wanted because I got sidetracked and showed you the base and, you know, we're doing some food and doing some seeds and then crafting more blocks and had to do some adjustment on the mountain. So uh, sorry about that. It's just there's only so much time like to record and I wish um, I could show more each episode. Um, but I will do a lot of stuff, uh, as I said, between episodes now. And you can enjoy it, then you know the direction I'm going. I showed you some of it, so it's not going to be, uh, ooh, how, you how did you do that kind of moment. It's more like, okay, fair enough, that's, that's what he's doing. And that's the direction I'm going. So we go into Omicron in the next episode. And if you did enjoy the episode, as always, kick the like button in the arse. Like the gaming ninjas you are, like you're already doing, you're amazing. I mean, I just the last couple of weeks, like the videos, you guys are so supportive. And I love your criticism as well. When I do something that's not really good or when I do something stupid, you're saying, listen, you could have done this better and all that. This is really awesome. And you guys are really nice about it. And I really appreciate that. It makes this all so much more worthwhile than it already is. And thank you. Excuse me. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, pardon me. Oh, kind of came unexpected. Um, all right. Okay, so I hope I see you guys in the next episode then. And until then, viel Spaß and happy gaming.